what's the science family welcome back to another video today we'll be starting the next led zeppelin album this is in through the outdoor track number one in the evening we're not going to waste your time we're going to jump straight into it but before we do if you guys want to let me know any background information about the album cover the recording process uh what they did between the time between the last album and now uh, any of that good stuff you want to let me know feel free to let me know down in the comment section below with all that being said, let's check this out. In the evening, track number one. This is Enter the Outdoor. Let's check it out. Right off the bat, it sounds very, very 80s influence or 80s style, whatever you want to say, whatever the proper uh, terminology you want to use to describe it, um, which is not a bad thing whatsoever. I feel like they definitely were adapting to the times with this record. I mean, based off the first minute, I can't, you know, jump the gun here, but you can tell with the the vocal effects that Robert Plant's using, the, the synths in the background. Uh, yeah, I mean, it makes sense, man. Synth pop was very popular during this time, so uh, it only makes sense, but yeah, not a bad track so far. The bass guitar is crazy.
Okay. Okay, nice little smooth transition. I like it. Okay. All right. And that was In the Evening by Led Zeppelin. Not a bad opening track. Like I said there in the beginning, I'm going to repeat it here again. Very 80s style. Not influenced because it is the 80s. So I guess you can't be influenced by the time you're currently in. Very 80s style with the, the, the vocal effects that Robert Plant's using. Uh, the bass line, the, the guitar, the arpeggio on the guitar. Um... The, the 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 sense in the background everything just screams 80s uh which i like i said it's not a bad thing you can just kind of tell that they were adapting to the times um which for me is led zeppelin standards is not really what i anticipate and it doesn't really meet my standards for led zeppelin because i would expect them to try something new i would expect them to step out of the box and step away from the competition and step away from the sound of that current time period and try something new but i guess you know they fell victim to maybe uh label stuff and you know maybe they the label wanted them to do more current style music or whatever they wanted them to do uh but um yeah i mean it's not a bad song it's not my favorite opening song in the Led Zeppelin album. If you were to play it to me, I wouldn't tell you to skip it, but I would probably be like, hey, you know, there's other better Led Zeppelin opening songs, uh, opening tracks, if you will. But again, it's not a bad song. I don't dislike it. I don't necessarily love it. I'm kind of indifferent about it. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Let me know any background information about the song, any background information about the recording process or any instruments that they used or where their head was at during this time you know any of that good stuff would be good to hear 
Um, you know, typically when you guys send me the comments and send me more information and details about the song, I tend to appreciate them a little more and I, I look at them in a new light and I, uh, I can see why people love the tracks and I, I have a newfound respect for the tracks that you guys, um, you know, give information to me towards when I'm not necessarily feeling it. Yeah, that's going to wrap this video up. Thank you guys for watching. Please make sure to leave a comment. It would be greatly appreciated. Helps out with the algorithm. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching. Peace, love, positivity. Love you guys. Take care of yourself. Peace.